So, my aircon makes a beep. Which isn't too bad right now, but when it's night time, it's ridiculously loud. So I'm going to try and find some way to make that quieter. I'm not sure how, so I wouldn't say this is a guide or tutorial at all. It's the same sort of beeps that you get in, like, microphones. Microphones? Microwaves. Not microphones. That'd be weird. Um, and other devices of that sort. So, yeah, let's see what we can do. Well, it's that, which I knew, but finding it was easier than I thought. Very loud. But I realised that I can't hold the phone at the same time, so that's good. Either way, if you put, given how they work, a little bit of pressure on it, quietens it. I don't know what long-term effects this may or may not have, but there you go. Can I hold the phone anyway? I don't think I can. What does that button do? Hold on. That one is temperature, so I should be able to press both. Eh. See? Off. On. So my logic is to possibly... Uh, let's unplug it first, just in case. I don't know what... Capacitor might still be charged. I don't... No, you go away now. Oh, my bad. You... Try not to touch it. It's very difficult because it's stuck to this... Whatever. Right, I had a thought. Was because there's quite a big gap. Generally, if you put anything... Whoa, that was logical of me. Wow, good job. Can't see anything. There's a little... Dirty phone, you're not going to focus on that? Jeez. Oh, there's a little gap in there. So if I put something in there, what do I put? I could put tissue, but that seems like a bit of a, an unsafe thing to do. I could just break off a bit of stick. I'll work it out and I'll come back. Okay, I think I figured it out. Bits of... you can't see. God dang it. It's not going to help my hand either. Ugh. Bits of... Phone, would you focus? Thank you. Bits of like plastic cut up and then like woven into springy things. But I got bored, so that's that. And just in between the piezo electric buzzer plate thing and the case. And that makes it a lot quieter because it stops it from vibrating as much or something. I don't know how they work completely, but whatever. Wow, focus. Seriously? Jesus Christ. Yes, well, I can't, uh -huh. I can't exactly do this on the camera, so I'll be back in a sec. Figured a little rubber washer makes more sense. But still with a bit of plastic, because it still needs that extra thickness to stop it from being so loud. So, yeah, washer. Pretty handy. Awesome. It's so much quieter now. Oh, that is amazing. Sweet, sweet, sweet. I'll put it all back together and then, yeah point out I did try just insulating the sound covering up the, the hole and everything but it wasn't very effective it had it was it did a bit but not much um a resistor might have worked as well but I didn't really want to go to all that effort it seemed a bit fiddly for something quite simple um but yeah oh oh my god that's so quiet now nice which means I probably wouldn't be able to hear it from anywhere other than here, but yeah, that's fine. Um, if anyone watches this that knows a reason why that might be dangerous or could cause a fire or something, I don't know. Then let me know. <sighs> Other than that, if it catches on fire, I'll, I'll 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 try and remember to record it. So you know, awesome. Cheers then.